All right, folks, how we doing? Uh, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to take a look at the Jamp Mark One Amp Sim by Lost in Seventies. But before we get into all that, please like, subscribe, share. Much appreciated. Here's the uh, the Amp Sim. As you can see, it's very much based on a 60 slash 70 style amp. So you get your little uh, tubes for you guys in the US, uh, valves in this side of the pond. Um, you've got a three band EQ, volume, uh, and there's a, on a lot of 70 amps, you've got a reverb and you've got an overdrive. And it's four channel amp, so you've got clean, crunch, an overdrive and a distortion. And there's model one and on model two. And it comes with a bunch of cabs. So you've got five different variations of cabs. Oh you can plug in your own IRs. Um, and I've got a tube screen in front of this from uh, Mercurial. I've got that on the modern setting. So we'll go through some tones and uh, I'll give you my thoughts at the end. Right, so I'll start it off on the uh, on the clean channel. Uh, I've got everything at 12 o'clock apart from uh, just got a little bit of overdrive on and just a little bit of reverb on. So I'll uh, go through everything. I'll throw all the different cabs. So I'll start off on the clean. As you can hear, uh, using the different cabs gives you a totally different sound. So then we'll uh, just pop a little bit of crunch on. Tube screamer. Just gives it that little push, and then we go to the overdrive section. I'll just knock that reverb down a touch. And then we'll 
bang it onto the distortion channel. So I'll start back off on cab one again. <laughs> channel you can definitely hear the difference in each of those cabs um, I think my favorites at the moment um, cab 3 and cab 5 uh, I think they give I don't think there's much difference in them I, I, I think, uh, cab 3 just gets uh, just gets the nod <laughs> There it is, the uh, the Jump Mark One uh, from Lost in Seventies. Uh, my thoughts on it: it's not bad. Um, yeah, it's not going to give you that, even, even with the tube screamer in front. It's not going to give you the, the modern tones. <coughs> um, you're not going to you get s somewhere near a modernish type tone, but it's not that kind of amp. It's it's an old style British amp, so you're gonna get an old style British sound from it, and that's not a bad thing. Uh, <laughs> could be from a, an old style British guy that uh, had his childhood in the 70s listening to Sabbath. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I like it. Uh, I may use it every now and again if I write something in that sort of style. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, oh, by the way, uh, this is a, a free plugin as well, so I'll, I'll put a link in the description uh, where you can get hold of this. And thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video. Hello, folks. Thanks for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that video, and uh, if you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up, and uh, don't forget to subscribe 
and hit that bell for notifications of videos coming out all the time and feel free to leave comments and if you want to see me uh, reviewing or demoing uh, a piece of gear also pop that in the comments uh, I do read them all and they're all very much appreciated and down below in the description uh, there's links to my social media networks if you want to follow me and also uh, a link to PayPal if you'd like to uh, donate to the channel any donations will go to pieces of year thanks for watching i'll catch you later keep it loud and keep it heavy <laughs> <laughs>